Now, there's lots of excitement across Merseyside at the moment as next week sees the launch of Go Penguins. Go Penguins. The event highlighting Liverpool's Year of the Environment. Go Penguins. Go Penguins will showcase the best of Liverpool's creativity with over 100 five-foot painted... painted. Go, go Penguins. Yeah, it's not really working, is it? They're all going to be scattered right across the city. It was working. They go are penguins. being put in go place penguins. over the weekend before being officially unveiled to the city on Monday. But there's one in particular that we're interested in. Our showbiz queen, Miss Hacking, went to view all the completed penguins and, of course, our very own Granada Land one. Go Penguins. Yeah. <laughs> Remember a few weeks ago when all the penguins were dull and boring? Well, not anymore. They've all been painted and ready to hit the streets of Liverpool. All 135 of them. Don't forget about the 88 chicks, too. Our Granada Land penguin is looking fantastic. Are you happy and proud with it? I am really, really happy with it. I try to be as faithful as possible to Leah's design, you know. It's taken about three or four days with priming and then drawing and then painting it and now it just needs to be varnished and then it'll be on, on its way with the others on the parade. Last year, Superland Bananas were so popular throughout Liverpool. How do you think the penguins are going to go down? I think these will be even more popular than the Superland Bananas, really. And that's saying something. There'll be this riot of colour all, all, all over Merseyside, so, you know, it'd be great. So, what does the winner of our competition, 14-year-old Leah Holt from Rosendale, think of Mike's interpretation of her design? So, what do you think, Leah? Here it is, finished product. It's, oh, my God, it's brilliant. <laughs> Talk us through your design, then, Leah. I just had it in mind that it was about CO2 and climate and everything, climate change, um, to do with the weather and everything. So, I will try to get a bit of everything in there. My favourite bit is the lightning through the beak. Have you got a, a personal favourite on the penguin? On its back, where all the footprints are leading up to CO2. Very proud, yeah. <laughs> Leah, how does it feel for you, painting on your design? Oh, nerve-wracking. I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> what I liked about doing the penguin is that everything's my own idea. It's good if you have your own imagination and your own theme to it, rather than somebody telling you what to do. Well, after Granada's penguin, this one, which is called Sleeping Beauty, is definitely my favourite. Check out those eyelashes and look at those slippers. This is good too. Bit of bling. See, this one's good too. I love the hairy chest. Just can't decide. 